Now I'm going to jog your memory. And yesterday I gave you a puzzle. Do you remember? It had these three numbers in it. Can someone help me remember? What was the 100 about? What was that? 100 kilos, 100 kilos of potatoes, because I was hungry, right? 99, what was that about? Uh, the percentage of, uh, that's how much. Water. That's how much water started off in the potatoes, right? And then what did I do? I was a bit lazy. Then you left, left it out. And left it out, it dried until such a point that there was only 90% water left 98%. over. Okay, sorry, 98%, right? So, so now I'm gonna repose that question to you and this time I'm gonna give you a couple of minutes to actually try and solve it. My original question was, okay, how many kilos of potatoes do I have now? I started here, what am I gonna end up with? I'll give you a couple of minutes and here's my big clue for how you might approach it. You don't have to approach it this way, but it's a suggestion. If you think you have an answer, Call me over and I'll come to you so you don't spoil it for everyone. Okay, couple of minutes. Um, some of you have some solutions. I've seen a couple of people with the same answer, a couple of people with different answers. I'm gonna give you my answer. You might be surprised by what the answer ends up being. My challenge to you would be, if it's surprising, number one, why is it surprising? Is it surprising because you think it's wrong? And if it is wrong, what's the problem like what have I done wrong maybe you'll be able to find a step in the working that I'm going to be putting down and you can copy down with me so you can follow along and if it's not wrong then could maybe it be right even though it's surprising here's how I'm going to approach it here here is my starting situation okay lots of potatoes lots of its water okay now what's tricky is because I've given it to you in percentages Right? This is the sneaky part of it and the counterintuitive part. A lot of people have said to me as their answer, they've suggested, well, maybe 99 kilos of potatoes are left because it looks like you've kind of lost one. Or maybe, if you're like really sneaky, maybe it's 98.9 kilos are left. That seems kind of reasonable, doesn't it? Okay. Oh, um, or 98.8. Okay, so in that ballpark. Here's the way I'm going to break this down. Think about the starting situation a little more carefully, right? If there are 100 kilos and 99% of is water, then how much is water in kilos, not nine, percentages? Nine kilos. It's 99 nine. kilos, right? 99 kilos of water. You yeah. agree with that? Sure. Okay. Now that tells you quite quickly, therefore, how much is not water. By the way, in case you didn't know, uh, it's starch, yeah. basically, right? So what's left over is one kilo, right? One kilo, which doesn't seem very much, does it? That's starch, okay, not water. Are you happy with that? All right, now what happens when things change? Okay, when, you know, when I left them for a week and they probably kind of turned green and stuff like that, and grew, grew shoots. Water went away, right, water went away. So there's gonna be less water. How much starch went away? Like they're just sitting there. No starch went yeah. anywhere, right? All the starch is still there. So how much starch will there be? One, one, it will be one kilo. one kilo of starch. Still, right? Still. Now hold on a second, hold on, hold on. 98% is water. So what percentage is not water? Two. Two percent, right? One wow. kilo starch, that's two percent. Right? Okay, now the unitary method is really handy because that's 2%. Well, what's what's 1% then of the actual weight that's left over? 500 grams. It'll be 500 grams or, or half a kilo, right? Half a kilo, that's 1%. So if I want the whole thing, the actual leftover, uh, how do I go from 1% to 100? I multiply by 100. So I go one times 100, percent a half is um 0 0.5 right yeah. half a half yeah. of a hundred I believe that's 50, yeah. 50, 50, kilo. 50 kilos I should have just waited a week before I bought it because they charged me by the kilo right really this is a bit surprising isn't yeah. it this this percentage has hardly changed yeah. but the weights changed a lot do you believe it no. If you yes. don't believe it, it's a rhetorical question. If you don't believe it, here's my working. 
where do you think you know when magicians are like doing card tricks and that kind of thing, yeah. right? There's always a trick. There's something that's like, ooh, there's the thing. And once you spot that, it all works, right? Is there a trick here? If you think there is, can you find it? 